The Arkansas Children's Nutrition Center is one of six human nutrition research centers within the USDA ARS's national program in human nutrition. We're unique in being one of two that focuses on child and maternal development and health, and that we focus both on the impacts of maternal and child diet, as well as physical activity on those outcomes, as well as the risk of chronic disease later in life. All of our faculty hold appointments at the University of Arkansas in Medical Sciences, and many of our primary faculty hold appointments within the Department of Pediatrics. The Arkansas Children's Nutrition Center is essentially the research arm of the Arkansas Children's Organization. It plays a critical role in defining and delivering unprecedented care for children. The beginning of the Arkansas Children's Hospital Research Center was an integral part of the Nutrition Center, and all that started in about 1986. It took until at least 1994 that the center was actually uh, granted to Arkansas. It was a plan to first get the research facilities on this campus. The pediatricians that were working in research had no facilities here, so there was no infrastructure, uh, there were no laboratories, no clinical research centers to do their research. So before we could even think about getting a nutrition center here, we had to have facilities and an infrastructure that would support a research program for pediatricians. It was a partnership uh, in collaboration with the USDA to build the second uh, of two maternal and child-focused nutrition centers, developing science to support evidence-based guidelines to promote health and prevent disease for children. It was initiated by the department chairman of pediatrics, Dr. Robert Pfizer. Dr. Pfizer had this vision of improving pediatric care in Arkansas. There's a lot of rural children in Arkansas. Undernutrition is fairly high. Nutrition is an important part of child development and learning about nutrition and uh, the needs of families was very important. And so it, it just fits. A children's nutrition center in Arkansas is the place to do this. Arkansas is a small state. We don't have very many people, but it had the guts to go after this. It has always, from its beginning, had a unique focus on child and maternal health. And it's incredible to see 30 years of tremendous research coming to fruition and impacting dietary guidance and, and health on a daily basis. So the earlier days of ACNC, I was in areas of the clinic where I actually ran study visits. We had about one study we were working with on a daily basis. Now we are working with multiple studies on a daily basis. So it's really evolved from looking at babies at starting at two months all the way up to six years. And now we are looking at moms during pregnancy and infancy and then elder kiddos. Again, the Nutrition Center is a full service research center that simultaneously does discovery science while also implementing evidence-based practices to really understand how those things work in real life environments. And so then providing guidelines, not just for children of Arkansas, but across the world. It's really exciting to be a part of the center that has really been you know, at the forefront of nutrition research, um, not just in the state, but nationally. The research here at the ACNC um, spans from really fundamental molecular studies to research studies looking at whole body metabolism and nutrition and physical activity. The preclinical labs upstairs are really critical for moving the needle forward on our scientific underpinnings. So I'm really excited about the future of the ACNC. We've recently recruited a new faculty member, Dr. Colin Kay, who runs the Metabolomics and Analytical Corps. And the work that his lab is doing will really bridge the gap between our clinical and preclinical studies by identifying metabolites that are important in parent and child nutrition and health. Here at the ACNC, we try to make it as family friendly as possible. Especially when you're dealing with children, it's like if they don't enjoy the place, they're not gonna wanna come back. 
but we want to make sure that's the opposite. And so the fact that it is so friendly and inviting, but at the same time they're doing high level research, it walks this really fine line, it has this really great balance to produce such awesome research. While our studies are big and, and the results can be big, each one of those numbers in those studies represents a person. Our research studies go on throughout the day because they have to meet our participants' schedules and people work and so um, some of our study visits are in the afternoon and even on weekends. So one of the studies I'm a part of, it is about five months long. It's coming in two times per week and the best thing I hear is that the moms when they're bringing in their child they say they couldn't wait to come in and see Dr. Cliff and do all the different physical activities and procedures that we do here for the study. The importance of the research we do here at the ACNC is because we're catering to the next generation coming up. We want to make sure that all the great physical activity habits, exercise habits, and nutrition habits that we learn about as adults, the children of the next generation learn that early on so they can build those habits. And it's not something you have to really learn when they become adults. It's really important to acknowledge how much the Arkansas Children's Nutrition Center has done to define and deliver unprecedented health and will continue to do so. And putting a focus on it and what it does is an important aspect to helping it continue to do its mission. We are actually addressing what families can do today for a healthier tomorrow for these children. I would love to see another generation of children from the Little Rock community and Arkansas more broadly coming back with their kids to enable our ability to do science for the next generation here.